Hello, I'm Dr. Garg. I'm a family physician at Coastal Family Medicine, and I'm here to speak to you about an important test for diabetics called hemoglobin A1C, or A1C for short. What is the A1C? It's a test we use to help understand how your sugars have been for the last two to three months. At home, when you check your sugars, you might check them in the morning before meals or two hours after a meal. The A1C gives us an average of all of those numbers over the last three months. Why is this important? The higher the A1C relates to a higher blood sugar level. For example, if your A1C is 7, your sugar on average is 154. If the A1C is 8, on average it's 183. Whereas if your A1C is 11, on average your sugar is 269. So what is your A1C goal? For most patients, the goal for your hemoglobin A1C is less than 7. In certain patient populations like the elderly, we might accept a goal under eight. It's important that you speak with your physician and come to an agreement as to what your goal is and work hard at maintaining that goal. What's the consequence of not having an A1C at goal? If you are an uncontrolled diabetic for a long period of time, it affects the blood flow throughout your body. Uncontrolled diabetes puts you at high risk for blindness, kidney failure, heart attacks, strokes, and reduced blood flow to your arms and legs. These are devastating consequences for a diabetic. Studies have shown that if you keep your diabetes at goal, whether it's under seven or under eight, the risk of these devastating complications are markedly reduced. It's important that you work with your coastal care team to keep your A1C levels at goal and maximize your treatment for your diabetes. It's not easy to care for your diabetes, but we are here to help.